Hello everyone, today I will show you how to use a program called DeepMosex, which can remove the mosaics in images or videos. Of course, you can use it to add mosaics. Okay, first of all, we should open the link and download Portrait Models and the program. I have downloaded them into the desktop. And there are two versions. The one is the CPU version and the another is the GPU version. I will use CPU version for an example and then I will show you how to install a GPU version. Firstly, we should unzip the CPU version file. Open the program. Choose the file you want to progress. Let's see the photo first. There are some more sex on the face and I will use the program to remove them. Then we have to choose the portrait models. Let's try clean face HD first. Then push strong and wait. Okay, let's check the output image. Oh, it looks great. And then we will try to add some more sex into a video. Let's see the video first. Okay, the boy is very handsome, but I have to close it. Then choose the model called Add Face. Input the start time and the last time of the video, and the default is the entire video. And then push wrong and wait. It will cost a long time on CPU version. Now you can see the preview window. Ok, it finished. And let's check out the opt video. This program can also remove more sex from videos. The only difference is to choose different portrait models. And I will not show it again. Okay, the next I will show you how to install GPU version. Let's open the help file. Before you use GPU version, you should make sure you have a NVIDIA GPU above GTX 1060. Okay, let's begin. Step 1. Install Visual C++ library. Copy this link, download and install it. And I have installed it, and I have to quit. Step 2. Update your GPU drive. Open this link, and input some info. Choose the version of Boo 441, then download it and install. You can just push next, and after you finish it, you have to reboot your computer. And the last step, install CUDA. Open this link, find CUDA 10.2, choose Windows 10 and local. Download this and then open the file you have downloaded and install it. Ok, let's check whether we are successfully. Open CMD, input NVIDIA, SMI. Make sure the CUDA version is 10.2. Then go to the course directory and enter diffmosx. If you see the same as me, it will work. Ok, now try to run this program on GPU. The base operation is the same as CPU version. But make sure alone use GPU. We can see the GPU memory has been occupied. Ok, that's all. Thank you for watching. If you like my project, you can give me a star on GitHub.